Welcome to the amazing new world of my virtual home. Welcome to a short My Virtual Home video about air conditioning. With My Virtual Home, a user can navigate into their Rooms menu, select the room that they particularly wish to put on their design, and resize it. When you have the room dimensions correct for the size of your room, you can go into the measurements here and place a north marker. Placing a north marker will enable you to set the sun for where the sun should reside for your particular design. As I scroll down in my menu here, you can see I've selected Brisbane, Australia. I could just as easily change that to another state, another country, or put in the exact time of date and year in our advanced lighting system as well. This will impact on the sun and which walls the sun is actually shining on. You can see because we paused there, My Virtual Home has added some windows. I'm going to delete two of those windows, three of those windows, and keep one of them. What we're interested in here today is if we click on the floor, and we click over here on our Plugins tab. It then brings up the plugins that are available for the room, in this case the Panasonic Air Conditioning Calculator. Clicking on that, we can select where we live, we can select whether we want heating or heating and cooling, we can select the type of insulation we have or if we don't have any insulation, we can select the number of people that are normally going to reside in this room, and any electrical equipment we have in the room, so if you've got a plasma or something like that, that may impact and we're going to be able to pick that up automatically from the software as well. We can then say calculate and it comes up with the right size calculation for that particular room. So we need a 3.4 kilowatt system for that room which is automatically calculated based on the windows that are exposed to the sun because we have a window in the design and the walls that are exposed to the sun. So it's pre-populated all of those values for us. We can then press the search button. Pressing the search button it comes up with the options that are available for us I can click on the top option there and bring it into my design. I'll place that air conditioner into my design here and I'll press on the 3D view. When we're in the 3D view here, we can zoom in on this particular unit and actually unpack our goods. So I can bring the air conditioning unit out of the box. I'll pop that one just up on the wall there for now. Get rid of your rubbish by just using the delete button and we can delete it as well. Come back up to your overhead view and we'll get this unit and bring it to the inside wall. When it's placed on the wall, well I want to do a back to back one here, something like that. Once again we'll press on our 3D view and this time we'll press on our walk view as well. We can come inside our design and place the air conditioner where we particularly need to. Let's say we want to place the air conditioner in that place there. If you walk up to the air conditioner and you double click on it, it will open up and animate as it's supposed to and then close it again. All the information is on hand about that air conditioner, what it's going to do for you, what it's made up of. And then we have our search directory at the bottom here where we can find the manufacturer, in this case Panasonic, someone who can supply it for me, someone who can fix it for me, or someone who can discuss it with me, i.e. an interior designer, so on and so forth. So that's my virtual home and picking the right size air conditioning calculator for your particular design here. In this case, just a single room. Hope you've enjoyed that presentation.